I made these cute Halloween candy monster cookies for spooky season. Look, I even did a little graveyard scene. I based the cookie dough for these off of the recipe on the bag of chocolate morsels with a couple of changes. First, I use salted butter and don't add any additional salt. I also use a tablespoon of vanilla instead of a teaspoon. Finally, I substitute half of the all-purpose flour with whole wheat flour. After these are rolled in colorful sugar, no one's going to know that you made them healthier. I separated some of my zombie graveyard sprinkles that I got from Sprinkle Me This. So I have one bowl of colorful sprinkles for rolling and then the eyeballs and bloody bones to decorate. So after I've rolled the dough balls in sprinkles and flattened them slightly, I'm giving most of them two eyes each. Then in the oven at 375 for 10 minutes. During this time, I'm going to unwrap my candy. I'm using Hershey's Miniatures. And I found that the special dark ones work especially well. It's important to push the candy in as soon as they come out of the oven so that it molds in with the cookie. I'm also adding some bloody bones sticking out of the corners of their mouths. And I used some of the special rest in peace headstones to make this graveyard scene. These sprinkles really made it so much fun. Now let these cool a little bit on the sheet before you move them to a wire rack to cool completely and then serve as you wish. Make them for Halloween or after to use up your leftover candy. Happy eating and happy Halloween.